This field's mine. This is my home. He is an Academy Award-winning actor who's now conquering the small screen, the one and only Kevin Costner. Have you ever wondered what goes on behind the scenes of your favorite TV shows? How exactly are those breathtaking visuals and inspiring characters brought to life? The mind wonders, don't it? Especially when a show has such a talented actor like Kevin Costner. This is America. We don't share land here. From his humble start, Costner's rise to fame is nothing less than admirable. When the famous show Yellowstone came on our screens, everyone started talking about how great the show was. From its storyline to the amazing chemistry between Kevin Costner and the talented Kelly Riley. The question is, how do such powerful actors have such an amazing balance in their relationship? Well, thanks to a conversation with Riley, we have gotten the answer to this. So get ready for a sneak peek into Hollywood's backstage as we navigate the ups and downs of Costner's life. Kevin Costner, Hollywood's finest star. Born on January 18, 1955 in the vibrant city of Linwood, California, Kevin Michael Costner emerged as a powerhouse in the entertainment industry. With his irresistible charm and extraordinary talent, Costner carved his name into Hollywood history, captivating audiences worldwide. He was a young boy growing up in the sunny streets of Compton, California. His parents, William and Sharon Costner, instilled in him the values of hard work and determination. Sharon, a dedicated welfare worker, and William, an electrician and utilities executive, provided the foundation for Kevin's dreams to flourish. Apart from the challenges life threw his way, Kevin was a person whose spirit was unbreakable. In his school days, Kevin was more of a sports lover than a bookworm. His passion was football, but as far as his interests are concerned, they didn't end there. He played piano, wrote poetry, and even kind of lent his voice to the First Baptist Choir. In between all this, a moment sparked a lifelong love affair, the day he watched the 1962 classics How the West Was Won. Little did he know that movie would ignite a passion for Western films that would shape his future. As destiny would have it, Costner's teenage years became a whirlwind of change, moving across different parts of California due to his father's career. New cities meant new challenges, yet with every move, Kevin discovered a new facet of himself. From Ventura to Visalia, he welcomed change, making friends and finding his voice in the world. High school saw him at Mount Whitney, marching proudly in the band. Later, he graduated from Villa Park High School in 1973, leaving behind a legacy in baseball. But his thirst for knowledge didn't stop there. In 1978, he earned his B.A. from California State University, Fullerton, where he became a brother in the Delta Chi fraternity. It was during this time that the seeds of acting and dancing were planted, blossoming into a passion that would define his life. A young man on a plane, returning from his honeymoon in Puerto Vallarta, none other than Kevin Costner, and destiny was about to knock on his door. In a chance encounter with the legendary Richard Burton, doubts about his career choices surfaced. Should I become an actor? He pondered. Burton's advice was the push he needed, the push that set him on a path towards stardom. Inspired and determined, Costner bid farewell to his marketing job after 30 days. Acting became his muse, and he embraced it wholeheartedly. But the road to fame was not paved with gold. To refine his craft, Kevin took on various jobs, from working on fishing boats to being a truck driver. The Hollywood Hills became his playground as he gave tours of stars' homes, all the while honing his skills and attending auditions. His journey was a testament to his unwavering dedication. In the vibrant college days, our handsome hero was struck by Cupid's arrow as he swept fellow student Cindy Silva off her feet. Sparks flew, and in just three short years they exchanged vows, starting a family that grew with the arrival of two daughters in 84 and 86, and a son in 88. But alas, love's path isn't always smooth. After 16 years, their love story ended in 1994 due to rumors of a flirtation on the set of Waterworld, resulting in an $80 million settlement for Cindy. But fear not, for the heartthrob didn't stay single for long. A brief affair with Bridget Rooney led to the birth of a son, and then 
he found solace in the company of political activist Birgit Cunningham. The mid-90s saw him in the enchanting embrace of supermodel Elle McPherson. Love finally knocked at his door again in 2004 as he tied the knot with the beautiful Christine Baumgartner. Together, they created a joyful family with two sons and a daughter. Yet even the strongest bonds can face storms. And sadly, on May 23rd, Kevin and Christine parted ways, finalizing their divorce later that year. Now let's talk politics. Kevin Costner, once a Republican, switched sides in the 90s, becoming a staunch supporter of the Democratic Party. His political passion sparked fire in his speeches, urging young voters to shape the future. He stood beside Barack Obama during the 2008 election, passionately emphasizing the urgency of change. In a heartfelt tribute, he saluted the troops worldwide, honoring their dedication. His political journey continued with endorsements. From Pete Buttigieg to Joe Biden, his voice resonated with support. Surprise, surprise! He even endorsed Republican Liz Cheney for the 2022 United States House of Representatives election. In this whirlwind of romance and politics, Kevin Costner's life is as colorful and unpredictable as the movies he stars in. Love, heartbreak, passion, and dedication. His story is a roller coaster. Costner's rise to fame. Let's rewind the clock to 1981, a year that marked the birth of a legend on the silver screen. A face emerged, not just as an actor, but as the embodiment of cinematic greatness. Kevin Costner's debut in Sizzle Beach, USA might have been subtle, but his destiny was far from ordinary. Picture yourself in the bustling streets of New York City in 1982. Enter Costner, not just another face in the crowd, but as frat boy number one in Ron Howard's Night Shift. Imagine the vibrant energy of a frat-style party in an unexpected setting. The morgue. Music thumping, laughter echoing, and there he is, Costner with a beer in hand personifying the essence of youth. It was more than just a scene. It was a sneak peek into the immense potential within him, a glimpse of the marvels he would soon bring to life on the big screen. The pivotal year of 1985 arrived, marking Costner's ascension to stardom. Silverado became the cornerstone of his breakthrough, a moment when audiences sat up and took notice. His portrayal of Alex, a friend whose tragic demise binds a group together, showcased a depth of emotion that resonated deeply with viewers. It was more than just a role. It was a testament to his craft. Costner's friendship with director Lawrence Kasdan was the spark that ignited their collaborative fire, promising a series of unexplored cinematic adventures. Then came 1987, a watershed moment that catapulted Costner into the stratosphere of stardom. He embodied Elliot Ness in The Untouchables, a federal agent fearlessly battling crime and assumed the enigmatic leading role in No Way Out. These roles solidified his A-list status, but it was the magic of baseball in Bull Durham, 1988, and the soul-stirring journey of Field of Dreams, 1989, that endeared him to hearts worldwide. And just when you thought he had reached the pinnacle in 1990, he took a bold leap into production alongside Jim Wilson, birthing TIG Productions. Their brainchild, Dances with Wolves, directed and led by Costner himself, became a magnum opus, earning accolades, clinching Oscars, and etching his name indelibly in the annals of cinema history. The 90s unfolded as a canvas for Costner's versatility. He donned the iconic green tights as Robin Hood in Prince of Thieves and delved deep into the passionate character of District Attorney Jim Garrison in JFK. Who could forget the heart-wrenching romance of The Bodyguard, where he shared the screen with the incomparable Whitney Houston? And then there was the complexity of A Perfect World, a criminal on the run, paired with a young accomplice, showcasing Costner's ability to breathe life into multifaceted characters, making them unforgettable. Even as the late 90s and early 2000s brought challenges, true legends emerged stronger from the storm. 13 Days marked a resurgence, capturing the essence of historical drama with Costner's portrayal of Kenneth O'Donnell. Then, as the director of Open Range, he earned critical acclaim, proving his mettle behind the camera. His supporting role in The Upside of Anger showcased a different facet, earning him praise and awards. 
Amid career fluctuations, Costner's dedication remained unshakable. The 2010s witnessed his triumphant return to the director's chair and noteworthy roles in Hatfields and Amp McCoys, a miniseries that resonated with millions, and Hidden Figures, where he portrayed a NASA supervisor. His foray into television with Yellowstone marked a new chapter, proving his mastery extended beyond the silver screen. And who could ignore his distinctive timbre as the voice of Enzo, the wise dog, in The Art of Racing in the Rain, captivating audiences in a way only he could. Then, at 22, Costner embarked on his most ambitious project, Horizon, an American Saga. This Western epic, split into four films, promises entertainment and an immersive experience, a testament to his enduring passion for storytelling. With each frame, Costner strives not merely to tell a story, but to craft an epic echoing the spirit of the American frontier, leaving an indelible mark on the cinematic landscape. In the dynamic realms of the 1980s and 1990s, Costner emerged as the leading man, gracing the silver screen with iconic roles that have become timeless classics. From the fierce lawman in The Untouchables to the soul-stirring portrayal in Dances with Wolves, Costner's talent knew no bounds, earning him both awards and the hearts of millions. Costner, the cinematic maestro, didn't just stop at conquering movies. He seamlessly transitioned to television, becoming the beloved Devil Ants Hatfield in Hatfields and Amp McCoys and the formidable John Dutton in Yellowstone. His performance in the latter not only earned him a Screen Actors Guild Award nomination, but also a coveted Golden Globe Award, a testament to his brilliance on the small screen. But that's not all. Costner's accolades paint a picture of his astounding achievements. Not just one, but two Academy Awards for Best Picture and Best Director for the iconic Dances with Wolves in 1990 showcase his mastery behind and in front of the camera. The Golden Globe Awards, too, bowed to his excellence, honoring him for his outstanding roles in Dances with Wolves, Hatfields, and Amp McCoys, and the enthralling Yellowstone. And as if that wasn't enough, Costner proudly holds a Primetime Emmy Award for his captivating role as outstanding lead actor in a limited or anthology series or movie, alongside two Screen Actors Guild Awards, cementing his status as a true industry titan. Costner isn't merely an actor, he's a force of nature, a magnetic presence that illuminates every frame he graces. His filmography reads like a mesmerizing journey through time, each role etching his name deeper into the hearts of moviegoers. Bull Durham, Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves, The Bodyguard, each film a testament to his versatility and depth as an actor. In Message in a Bottle, 13 Days, and Hidden Figures, he showcased his prowess in diverse roles, leaving an indelible mark on the industry. Kevin Costner isn't just a name, he's an institution, a beacon of inspiration for generations of actors and storytellers. His legacy isn't just in the awards he's won, but in the emotions he evokes and the stories he brings to life. Costner's journey celebrates talent, dedication, and the unwavering spirit that defines true Hollywood greatness. Baffling versatility and musical career. In a harmonious fusion of talent and passion, Costner takes center stage as the lead singer of the sensational band Kevin Costner and Amp Modern West. Inspired and encouraged by his wife, Christine, Costner embarked on this thrilling musical odyssey that has captivated audiences worldwide. October 2007 marked the beginning of a global tour that saw Costner and his bandmates grace stages from Istanbul to Rome. But that's not all. They even rocked the tracks at NASCAR Sprint Cup Series races, leaving fans in awe at Daytona International Speedway and Charlotte Motor Speedway in Concord, North Carolina. Their music, a blend of raw energy and heartfelt lyrics found its home in their country album, Untold Truths, released under Universal South Records. This masterpiece made waves, peaking at number 61 on the Billboard Top Country Albums and securing the 35th spot on the Top Heat Seekers chart. Three sensational singles, Superman 14, Long Hot Night, and Backyard, took the airwaves by storm. Each note resonated with passion, Though they may not have hit the charts, they certainly hit the hearts of listeners. The magic didn't stop there. A live music video for Superman 14 
brought their electrifying stage presence to life, captivating audiences worldwide. In 2009, the band embarked on a memorable tour, sharing their musical prowess with the world alongside opening act The Alternate Roots. But their journey wasn't all smooth melodies and harmonious chords. In a moment of tragedy at the Big Valley Jamboree in Camrose, Alberta, a thunderstorm struck, leaving devastation in its wake. Yet amidst the chaos, the spirit of generosity prevailed. Costner and his bandmates rallied the community, raising funds for the children left behind, a testament to the power of music and humanity. Costner's musical legacy grew stronger with their second album, Turn It On, released on February 2010. Europe welcomed them with open arms, embracing their music with unbridled enthusiasm. The band's generosity knew no bounds as they performed at the 20th annual TELUS World Skins Game in Halifax, Nova Scotia, supporting the IWK Health Center Foundation. A guitar bearing Costner's autograph found a new home, symbolizing the band's commitment to making a difference. But that's not all. Their latest creation, Tales from Yellowstone, transported listeners into the world of John Dutton, Costner's character from the hit TV series Yellowstone. This musical masterpiece found its place in season three of the show, weaving a melodic tapestry that mirrored its gripping narrative. Yet, music isn't the only realm where Costner's passion shines. Baseball fans recognize him not only for his iconic roles in baseball-themed movies like Bull Durham, Field of Dreams, and For Love of the Game, but also for his genuine love for the sport. A familiar face at Texas Longhorns baseball practices and games, Costner's connection to the game runs deep. His friendship with former Longhorns baseball coach Augie Garrido further solidified his bond with the sport. Costner's dedication extended to owning a share of the Lake County Fielder's independent baseball team, an homage to the iconic Field of Dreams, business, and philanthropic ventures. Costner's entrepreneurial spirit led him to venture into the business world. He delved into the realm of oil separation machines, a venture that gained significant attention during the Deepwater Horizon oil spill. Costner's innovative approach, coupled with his commitment to environmental causes, made a difference in the face of environmental challenges. Despite legal battles and controversies, Costner's vision stood firm, leaving a lasting impact on the industry. On a different note, Costner's heartwarming philanthropic endeavors illuminate his compassionate side. Serving on the honorary board of the National World War I Museum in Kansas City, Missouri, he lent his voice to raise awareness for a noble cause. His involvement in NASCAR further showcased his dedication to the community, where he took on the role of ceremonial Grand Marshal, adding his star power to the adrenaline-fueled races. When it comes to the literary world, Costner's creativity knows no bounds. Co-authoring The Explorer's Guild, A Passage to Shambhala in 2015, he ventured into adventure and graphic novels, proving that his talents extend far beyond the silver screen. But that's not all. In the digital age, Costner embraced innovation. Joining forces with Woody Sears, he became a co-founder, podcast narrator, and investor in the groundbreaking audio entertainment travel app, Here Here. Through this venture, he shared captivating stories, allowing travelers to connect with the places they visited on a deeper level. Costner's star power doesn't just light up Hollywood. It illuminates the world with his musical prowess, entrepreneurial spirit, literary talent, and philanthropic heart. As we journey through his multifaceted endeavors, one thing becomes abundantly clear. Kevin Costner isn't just an icon. He's an inspiration, a force of creativity and kindness, shaping the world in more ways than one. Now, it's time for today's subscriber pick. The immensely talented Kelly Riley steals the spotlight alongside Hollywood legend Kevin Costner. Since Yellowstone's explosive debut on the Paramount Network in 2018, Costner has embodied the role of John Dutton, the unyielding patriarch of the Dutton family, owners of the largest contiguous cattle ranch in the United States. Amidst the intense drama and fierce disputes, Beth Dutton stands tall as her father's unwavering advocate, adding layers of passion to the storyline. In an interview with Looper, Riley opened up about her remarkable chemistry with Costner, describing their working relationship as a treasure trove of experiences spanning four years, which can be seen in this picture. 
Her admiration for Costner's talent and generosity was palpable. According to Riley, Costner isn't just a co-star. He's a phenomenal actor whose work she deeply respects. Their on-screen synergy and genuine camaraderie have created an incredible dynamic, making their scenes together a true joy to watch. She confessed to feeling the weight of cinematic history with iconic films like Bull Durham, Dances with Wolves, and Field of Dreams flashing through her mind. Yet, Costner's professionalism and expertise swiftly dissolved any apprehension, allowing the actors to delve into their roles easily. The electrifying energy between the characters and the actors' palpable chemistry continues to elevate the show, drawing viewers deeper into the heart of Yellowstone's gripping narrative. In the vast landscape of television, Yellowstone is a testament to the power of exceptional storytelling and extraordinary performances. Kelly Riley and Kevin Costner, along with the talented ensemble cast, breathe life into the characters, making them relatable, memorable, and utterly captivating. The magic happens not just because of their talents, but also because of the undeniable connection they share on screen. Which dynamic duo from Yellowstone is most captivating? Kelly Riley and Kevin Costner as Beth Dutton and John Dutton or the electrifying chemistry between their characters that adds a new layer of intensity to the show. Let us know in the comments below what Yellowstone star Kelly Riley had to say about working with him. Kelly Riley has been setting our screens ablaze with her electrifying portrayal of the fierce Beth Dutton since she was 18. In each episode of season four of Yellowstone, Riley's dynamic energy, coupled with the legendary Kevin Costner's presence as John Dutton, has captivated us all completely. In the heart of the action, Beth and John, partners in crime, charged ahead at full throttle, bringing their absolute best to the table. But what's excited us isn't just the on-screen fireworks, it's the magic brewing behind the scenes. Riley spilled the beans, giving us a peek into the enchantment that happens when she collaborates with the prolific Kevin Costner. Believe us when we say sparks are flying and the energy? It's not just palpable, it's infectious. And let's talk chemistry. Riley's connection with co-star Cole Hauser, the charismatic Rip Wheeler, is phenomenal. Rip, the rugged cowboy, is inching closer to winning Beth's heart and the chemistry between Riley and Hauser? It's off the charts. This isn't just acting. It's living and breathing their characters, making us wholeheartedly believe in the intensity of their love story. The Yellowstone star took us on a wild ride filled with passion, affection, and drama. Hold on to your hats because there's more. Costner, though not a frequent face on the small screen, has masterfully embodied the character of John Dutton right from the series premiere. His portrayal is nothing short of a masterpiece, and the way he weaves the tale of the Dutton family keeps us perched on the edge of our seats, episode after episode. In Yellowstone, emotions run deep, and family ties are at the core of this enthralling saga. Costner's rendition of John Dutton, complemented by Riley's genuine admiration, crafts a television experience that plucks at your heartstrings and refuses to let go. Imagine a world behind the camera, where talent intertwines with camaraderie, Every scene becomes a canvas, and every shared moment transforms into a cherished memory. According to Kelly, for four splendid years, Costner and I have waltzed through the reels of numerous projects, knitting together a tapestry of friendship and creativity. Costner's presence on set isn't just inspiring, it's downright magical. His embodiment of kindness and generosity renders him one of the most remarkable actors I've ever worked with. Kelly Riley the unstoppable force as Beth Dutton, and the iconic Kevin Costner as John Dutton have brought us a concoction of talent, passion, and authenticity that's nothing short of legendary. Yellowstone isn't just a show, it's an experience, a roller coaster of emotions, and at the heart of it all are these incredible actors painting a vivid, unforgettable masterpiece on our screens. In another interview, she said, our collaboration transcends the confines of professionalism. It's a vibrant connection that adds magic to every scene we share, breathing life into our characters and stories. Costner isn't just an exceptional actor, he's a beacon of brilliance in the world of acting, leaving an indelible mark on the hearts of our audience. In acting, Costner stands tall, his talent shining brightly and inspiring everyone around him. 
His incredible portrayals are a testament to his dedication and artistry that captivates audiences and fellow actors alike. Watching him in action is like attending a masterclass, where every nuance, expression, and move speaks volumes about his craft. She said, His influence isn't confined to the screen. It extends to nurturing and inspiring those he works with. Kelly stated, in his presence, I am not just a co-star. I am a student eagerly soaking in his wisdom, learning not only about acting, but also about life's passion and the relentless pursuit of excellence. As the cameras roll and our shared moments are captured, I find myself evolving, embracing storytelling in its purest form, all under the gentle guidance of Costner. His encouragement propels me forward, urging me to explore new horizons, push boundaries, and strive for perfection. Working with him isn't just about portraying characters. It's about a shared journey, navigating the intricate lanes of the acting universe with a mentor, a friend, and a father figure. Our partnership isn't confined to entertainment. It's a celebration of art, passion, and the beautiful connections that can be forged amidst Hollywood's glitz and glamour. Kevin Costner isn't just a co-star. He's a revelation, enriching my craft, expanding my horizons, and filling my heart with gratitude. His warmth, talent, and generosity have transformed our professional collaboration into an exceptional experience, creating memories I will cherish forever. As I continue this exhilarating journey in the acting world, I carry with me the invaluable lessons learned from Costner, the echoes of his guidance, and the echoes of our laughter, reminding me that in the tapestry of Hollywood, some threads are meant to create lifelong bonds, weaving a tale of friendship and inspiration that resonates through the ages. She went on to say that John and Beth aren't merely characters, they're vibrant personalities that come alive on screen thanks to the genuine camaraderie shared off screen. Their incredible connection isn't just about following scripts. It's about the dynamic dance of emotions and energy that occurs naturally between them. Beth, known for her complexity, finds her match in John, and their scenes together are more than acting. They are a captivating display of genuine emotions and chemistry that mesmerizes us all. Who wouldn't be inspired in the presence of a legend like Kevin Costner? According to her, Working alongside him is a masterclass where his experience, dedication, and talent serve as a guiding light, illuminating the intricacies of acting for me. Costner's influence goes beyond the professional realm. It seeps into the very essence of my being, shaping not only my craft, but also my perspective on life and art. His mentorship isn't just about honing acting skills, it's about imbibing the spirit of passion and excellence that he embodies. This collaborative journey with Kevin Costner isn't just a professional endeavor. It's a testament to the power of genuine connections, shared passions, and the transformative influence of a mentor. It's a celebration of artistry, friendship, and the magic that happens when talented individuals come together to create something extraordinary. With every shared scene, every whispered piece of advice, and every burst of laughter, Costner enriches not just my acting abilities, but also my soul leaving an indelible mark on my journey in the world of entertainment. Here's to adventures, laughter, and unforgettable moments with a mentor and friend like Kevin Costner. Together, we don't just act. We create magic that resonates with audiences and lingers in the hearts of those who witness the beauty of our collaboration. From the immense regard and affection, Riley's words portrayed, tabloids were quick to jump to conclusions and speculate that something might be cooking between the two co-stars, but no one was able to find any solid evidence to connect them as romantic partners. So was this just a rumor? What do you think? We hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you in the next one.